Yeah, it starts with the first step. First step in, you're done after. You're done. Then, then after, you, the, once the first step is made toward you in your journey, you know, it's not too long after. It's astonishing the the small amount of time it's gonna take for thing great things to really happen. You know, I'm trying. I'm trying. We're gonna make an interview happen with the the lead singer of the group uh, Danakil. Danakil is a reggae a French reggae band and very uh, well known. And uh, that our Belik is a great great man. Uh, so I want to have an interview with him, so we're going to make it happen. Belik, Yanis Oduwa, you know, all the, the, the great minds of this world I want to I wanna reason with. I want to reason with great minds, with people that have no fear, with, you know, with people that have no ego. But when, once the fear is gone, once the fear is gone, the ego uh, goes out the door, pretty much. The ego is still a bit there, no? you need the... Uh, a little bit of a, an ego to function in this system, but it's not what's gonna lead your day. You know? It's not what's gonna. I don't know. It's love, compassion, and all the great stuff that's gonna be leading your journey to greatness, leading your ship, leading your ship to greatness island or greatness, whatever. It's about it's about greatness for sure. It's not about uh, it's not about drinking. So we know what the game is about. It's about greatness. It's about rising. It's about all this good uh, this good stuff. So if we know what the game is about, maybe we can uh, do something to get in the game, to play the game, to you know design your own race, not be part of this rat race. The rat race is the default state. The rat race is the default state and it's going to consume you if you let it. If you let it, it's going to consume you, going to consume all your life. Your whole life will be consumed, your soul capture, you're never going to get to the uh, real core of who you really are. You know, and this, I think, comes by actualizing your potential, your divine potential. You know, speaking to the world. Me, I... Me, I for me, this is my way. I want to speak to the world. I want to inspire uh, to greatness, inspire to live your dream. You know, that that's why I'm here. Because I want to live my dream. So if I can... And I know if I help people living, help people living their dream, I, no matter what, I, I'm, I'm, I'm living mine. You know, it's not about... What you need, what you need will come to you. What you need will be provided for you. Just do the work, focus on helping others, on giving back to life. You know, just act in the same way the divine would act if he would come down to earth in flesh. He would help people, he would help everybody. Everybody would have love and compassion. That's what we have to have. We have to get there. We have to get to that point. But for that, we got to start somewhere. We started a long time ago. I think that our journey has been started a while ago. Didn't just uh, start. Uh, we have started seeing clear a, a while ago. Le. Starting to see very clear in their program. Le. Especially, in the, I don't think it's because we're seeing more clearer or anything. I think it's just we have more ways of communicating with each other now. We have internet, so internet is is a must to use. Right? We must use it, but in a conscious way, in a very conscious manner. Can't lose ourselves in there. So much information in there. Right? So much information at our disposition. So stay forward. Stay forward, or you're going to end up in a Babylon hearse. Don't go on the reverse. Acknowledge the pain. Transcend it. Transcend your pain. Yeah. We all have pain. Whether it's physical or mental, we all have pain. Because we're all under trauma. You can have the both. You can have the physical and the mental. Don't let yourself stop by that. Simply do what you have to do. Don't listen to the voice inside voices of others. Uh, follow your heart. Your heart tells you you gotta rise. Rise up. Rise up and shine.
Your heart tells you you gotta move on, move on. Your heart tells you to do this, do it. Don't think too much. You know, think at once. Think at it once, uh, think about it once, but then you don't wanna hesitate. If you think too much, you're gonna hesitate before you do something. Just freaking do it. You have your fear, just freaking do it. And you're gonna transcend your, your fear. You're gonna, it's gonna transform you. I'm telling you, just try it. Try to, to, to go through your fears. You're gonna see, you're gonna transcend the whole thing. You're gonna transcend the whole thing and you're gonna come back to life. You're gonna come back to life, you're gonna feel your heart, you're gonna feel every cell of your body, everything. You're gonna feel, you're gonna be back to life. You know, that's what I think is happening once you start getting in touch with your mission, with the sacred mission that we all have here, that not all of us fulfill, but because they don't know, people don't know. No? People don't know the shit I'm talking about here. No? I didn't know that stuff, no? me, a couple of years ago. No? They know nothing of what I'm talking about here. No? Obviously, there's been an expansion of the of the consciousness or the awareness, expansion of the awareness. I think it's more our awareness of who we are and awareness of that fear is nothing we should uh, really listen to. So I think it's more awareness. Awareness also that life is short. That's the most awareness that I have, is that life is short and I can be gone at any moment. So I live it each and every day like it's my last. I take on each and every opportunity, every interview, every Every uh, thing I can do to help people, uh, I don't say, oh no, I got something. No, no, it's priority is a mission. The mission is the priority. Family, the mission. You know, we gotta set our shit straight. Uh. We gotta sh set our shit straight. I come here to set things straight. Maybe that's why I'm here to set things straight. To set things, things straight in my own personal life and set things straight in the other places if I can. But we must start to set things straight. It's about it. It's about waking up and speaking uh, truth. S stopping the lies. If we, all of us, we start speaking truth and uh, are conscious of our uh, behavior, what we say, what we... Come on. This whole thing's going to change. The whole vibration going to change. It's going to be sunny all the time. It's going to be uh, very few clouds just to equilibrate the... the but there's going to be so much positive energy on this plane that that's what the weather is going to reflect, the positive energy. You won't see so much madness or again and all that stuff. All the disaster that's happening, people flooded and oh, terrible. But I think a lot of that stuff is provoked too by, uh, by men. The government are doing wicked stuff. Whatever you think they are doing, they're doing a thousand times worse. So do your homework.